all right everyone in this video we will talk about like how to use the prompt function in your replit so as we know like the prompt function is it usually works with the integrated system environment of your browser so if we go over to the console and if i clear all and if i type like prompt any message in here like uh, enter your input anything like this okay and if i hit enter this is going to prompt with a message like whatever you want to input your input here you can just give it and hit ok and then after it works but what if we try to do the same in replit okay so first i'm going to create a REPL here um, under node.js i'm going to give it a name like uh, you know um, like for youtube i'm just going to create a REPL and inside this we are getting ready so by default it has created a index.js so we have an index.js and now whatever we write here it is going to work for sure okay so let's uh, type just for the demonstration let me uh, give it a program where it identifies whether we are like eligible for vote or not okay so i have given it let age equal to 18 and uh, we are going to create that output to equal to um if age is uh, your more than or equal to 18 um using the ternary operator here and uh, you can vote or just simple as like you can't okay so this is just a simple code and i'm going to console.log and i'm just going to give it output right and to run this we simply do hit run and it says you can what if we go like this the way it is you can't okay so this is working very fine so what if we want to you know like use the prompt function in it like i'm defining it i want to to use like prompt ask for like enter your age so if i hit will that work no not for sure so why isn't it working because it doesn't have an integrated browser handle where it could run so if you're running with a separate js file node.js file how to run it inside replit it's very easy okay so first we are going to click over new tab and we are going over the packages and we are going to install prompt package inside in here you can get this package called um, prompt sync at 4.2 points so just hit install and that's it okay the installation is done if we go back over to the console and if we try to run it now it still says that prompt is not a valid one so let me define it as uh, age equal to parse and it's an integer so age okay now if we try to run it again okay so we have to uh, define one more line like const we are going to name prompt and we are going to give it require okay and the package name the package name is prompt sync okay so it's going to be like prompt sync okay the prompt sync and one more in here and that 
that's it I think this is going to get the job done so this time if I rerun again you can see it's asking for our age so if I now enter 18 you can vote if I rerun it it's asking me over again like if I am 11 you can't so this way it's working fine now so if you really want to use the prompt function in a single node JS you can use this way to make it work okay so yeah that's pretty much it for this video thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video have a great day guys bye bye